It's time for Jim and Stuff Trading. Uh, people don't like these Wendy's numbers, and one of the things that's really interesting is that, is that they have this guy, Kirk Tanner. He's come in from PepsiCo, and I think he's terrific, but you do have a 5% yield, which is raise, raising eyebrows. Some people can't, uh, think they can't be sustained. Remember, McDonald's talked about how, how just difficult the business is. So, uh, Wendy's, you can either see it's a great opportunity, or you can be like my wife and just go eat the Baconator and move on. <laughs> Today, today, J.P. Morgan does cut to neutral yeah, on, on, big, the, big bull. on the back of what they see as looming price competition, to yeah, your point. Yeah, and that's just, I mean, look, we're getting price competition in a lot of places, including cybersecurity. Uh, so that's your that's your key for tonight leading into NVIDIA, I assume, is watching yes. Palo Alto's action. And remember, remember, long knives don't give up the ship. March 18 to 21, three-day love fest, 300,000 people listening to the keynote. There's more to it than a quarter. This man is not... It's like, go to the Da Vinci Museum in Rome, and he's got, like, a picture of the helicopter. But he had a lot of other things cooking, too. Um, if, if, the, if, there is a, if there is trouble after the bell, right? Yeah. What, what, gonna... How much of the rest of the market is vulnerable? Oh, I, I think it, there, is, there is, because AI is, uh, has created the biggest move uh, that we've seen in many, many years. So I think, yeah, there could be a, not a hiccup. I mean, there could be people say, listen, what was I doing? But I, I urge people to think longer term. That is not something anyone wants to hear on Wall Street. Right. Kind of reminds me of, uh, you know, Katie Huberty. Nice piece today. One uh, of them one yeah. of them basically arguing that uh, the bond markets have corrected to price in fewer Fed cuts, but stocks have not. No, and that's, uh, look, I don't think there'll be any cuts. I think that. Wait, are you the, saying there'll be no Fed cuts this year? That, I think if we keep up, if we don't have in, uh, employment above, unemployment's got to go to four and change. Or else I think that Jay's going to say, you know what, we're watching. We're watching. And I think that they're very worried about the thing I asked Brian Moynihan. They want to see something come down in price other than natural gas. That's their game. So, like, let's not get ahead of them. Uh, we'll see. Maybe the minutes will be instructive, but they are dated, Jim. Yes, they are. Very dated. I've got Realty Income, which is letter O. That's monthly income. I love it. And then I've got Brent Saunders from uh, Bausch & Lomb. Nice. First time. Wow, what a show. And get your load up your sports app. Uh, do not pillory the cash too much. There's a real company there, Palo Alto. And Jensen Wong, if you decide you're going to sell them, then why don't you go sell Taylor Swift? <laughs> we'll see you, see you at 6. Mad Money, 6 p.m. Eastern time.